Okay, the next uh, educator guide assessment we're going to talk about is soil nitrogen. And nitrogen is typically our most uh, limiting nutrient. It's also the most abundant at, or element uh, in the atmosphere. Uh, <clears throat> so um, the next section covers inherent factors affecting soil nitrogen. And those are primarily our soil texture, our soil steepness, anything that would impact either leaching of the nitrogen through the soil or runoff erosion processes that where we could lose some of the nitrogen through those processes. The next section you want to cover with your students in some basics would be nitrogen management and the primary management uh, schemes are nitrogen rate, nitrogen source, nitrogen placement, also your management practices that would go along with that such as irrigation management, your residue management, your crops, etc. Uh, so uh, nitrogen rates, probably one of the most important things, should be based on uh, the amount needed to optimize yield without over applying because we can cause some problems with some of the other uh, uh, soil tests that we mentioned earlier if we over apply nitrogen. Our timing uh, is important so that we put it as close to crop uptake as possible. Our fertilizer source, uh, different sources are going to have uh, can either leach or be lost through volatilization easily or more easily or less easily so that's important to cover also the placement so that we place it uh, place it uh, so in a manner so we don't lose it as, as easily and then irrigation scheduling and irrigated areas is important so that we don't over apply our irrigation water and leach out those nitrogens the next thing that's really important and probably the most important thing the students understand is is the soil the nitrogen cycle uh, so you need to cover that very clearly with them and that's figure two in in your your book or in your educator guide and it talks about the different uh, sources of nitrogen from fertilizer to to animal manure to to the different things that can occur such as uh, fixation from our legume crops and then in organic matter how it can mineralize and become available as well as ammonium or the different fertilizer sources how they convert first to nitrite and then to nitrite nitrate and then can be lost uh, either through leaching or they can be taken up by <clears throat> by plants etc so that's very very probably the most important thing to cover is that nitrogen cycle with your students